Hello everyone, in this tutorial I want to show you how we can create a country map from XYZ data or from latitude, longitude and altitude as you see. I have this data XYZ or long, lat and altitude. So first I have to save it as but I want to create a folder, specific folder for it in disk E, new folder create DEM okay CSV and you can choose CSV MSDOS save it okay. save it yes and go to uh, GIS from file add data add XY data here first we have to connect it to the folder to the RGIS choose the folder to which you want to connect it ok this PC new volume uh, new volume E and my folder fit DM ok that is the file I have select it at here for X field, select it side of T field on X axis, OK. In Y field, select it Y axis. And in Z, select it uh, altitude M. And also we have to apply a specific coordinate system for our data. From edit. OK. That's all the coordinate systems. From world, select it. WGS 1984 okay yes that's the data I have now we have to convert it to a TIN file TIN file so, uh, write TIN or it's better to write create TIN select it ok first select the path output path 3DM not this one E 3DM ok TIN Save. Coordinate optional input feature. We have to input this one, and here we have to select it uh, altitude M to high field mass point as it is. This one as it's okay. Just click OK. Now we created the TIM file, and we have to convert the TIM file to raster. Here we have also a uh, TIN to raster. You can select this one or you can write TIN to raster. Search for uh, TIN to raster. Select it TIN. Just uh, click OK. OK. Now we created our uh, DEM file from XYZ. If I uncheck this to one you see that's the dim and also i can ch uh, change some properties for it right click properties i want to change the color apply gamma stretch uh, also i want to apply a cold hot color for example this one apply Okay, you see is the high uh, elevation is 654.9 Oscars and the low elevation is 228.52. That's the DM file from XYZ. This is DM file. This is also a DM file, but a different one. But in the same way, we can you uh, we can create a DM file. I just combined it in my previous tutorial. Uh, to create a DM file and in this one 
I keep continue to create a contour. Okay, now we created uh, a DM file SVC. Then just from search, search for contour. Yes, contour, and insert a DM. Okay, inter validity 20 meter. It depends on you. For me, it's a large area, and the difference is about 330 meter. Interval depends on you. Okay. Now we created a contour lines, but we can make it more smooth by smooth. Search for smooth in search bar. Okay, smooth, smooth line. Input contour. That's the location where you want to save your output file. We have a different uh, algorithm. I choose pick. And regarding the smoothing tolerance, you have to uh, change. The, uh, you have to pick up or select the unit. I select meter. Smoothing tolerance, my area about 3000 or 4000 kilometers squared, so I select 10 meter. Okay. Now this one is more smooth. Okay. This one more smoother, like how if it's not a big difference in my work because it's too much, 4,000 kilometers square, a large area, that's why you can't see a, a difference clearly. Regarding the label, right click, property, select it, or tick label feature in this layer, and from label field, select contour, size, you can increase it, color, which color you prefer, uh, I selected black one and placement properties let the perpendicular place it one label per feature place it one label per feature part label is on the line not above the line and this one important position of the label on the line okay I think it's good apply Yes, that's the contour map we created. Uh, I was not clear uh, because the background color we can change it. Properties, symbology. If I choose this color, okay. Now it's good. I hope it can be helpful. Have a nice time.